rotor located inside. It's a cylinder that has holes bored in it at specific angles and depths, ranging from a few hundred holes up to a few thousand, depending on whether we're going to make hot water or steam. The key to the machine seems to be the number and the design of the holes in the rotor. Briggs has experimented with many different combinations to get the best results. The rotor fits tightly into a steel chamber with only a very small gap between the two. Water is fed into the gap and the rotor is spun rapidly by a small electric motor. As it spins, the water is pummeled and hammered through the holes. In seconds, it flows out of the cylinder as hot water or steam. What's so extraordinary about such an ordinary looking machine is the claim that it is more than 100% efficient. More energy has been measured coming out in the form of heat or steam.